Hey Joe, my name is Alex. I've just declared bankruptcy. How can I start rebuilding my credit and financial life? Great question, Alex. So this is kind of a loaded question. Um, and so I'm gonna try to break it down. So number one is we need to understand what it's gonna take to get ourselves back, right? And so depending on what type of bankruptcy you file, whether it's chapter 13, chapter 11, or chapter seven, we've got to figure out what the program is gonna look like with your bankruptcy attorney of when that debt's gonna be paid, taken care of so you can get back out of bankruptcy, can get discharged, and you can get back on with your life. So that's the first thing. We gotta figure out the timeline on that. Bankruptcy attorney is gonna break it out for you and tell you, you know, if we follow this, this is the timeline. The average uh, recovery from a bankruptcy is about three and a half to four years. Not longer, I've seen bankruptcies go their entire length of time. And so once that bankruptcy is over, then it's hard, we have to reestablish credit. Lenders hate seeing somebody go through bankruptcy. And so a bankruptcy, it's why I've always recommend look at every one of your options before you file bankruptcy. There are some people that have to file bankruptcy. It doesn't like they're, they're just in a really, really bad spot financially. And to be able to recover without a bankruptcy is going to take them just as long or it's going to maybe there's no really option for them. And so bankruptcy is the best option. Recovering after a bankruptcy, that's another five to seven years to fully recover. Some people say I've done it in two years. There's a lot of factors that go into it, but you know you can't get a, approved for a credit card for two years after a bankruptcy. And so you're gonna run into that situation. So you've gone through a bankruptcy for four years, and you gotta wait two years to get a credit card. So you're at a six year point before you can really start to establish and build credit. A lot of lenders are just, they just shy away from approving somebody after a discharge bankruptcy and discharge just means the bankruptcy has been completed now you can start to rebuild credit and so bankruptcies i've seen them really really put people's lives on hold when it comes to building credit for you know five to, to ten years and so just understand the impact that a bankruptcy has towards your credit before you do it obviously in your situation alex you've already filed for bankruptcy you're going through the process. just understand there's no really quick solution here got to get through the bankruptcy then we got to start to rebuild and establish credit which can take two years typically after a bankruptcy and once you're kind of in the clear you can start to just rebuild your credit and kind of start start fresh but creating the good financial habits now is the most important thing right most people's financial habits put them in bankruptcy and so what we have to do is reestablish the way that we have to set up a budget do it now so that when your credit is ready to be rebuilt, you have all financial structuring done so that you're on, utilizing a budget so that then you can build credit, build sustainable credit that's not going to be affected no matter what and will keep you from ever having to file bankruptcy a second time.